I've always wanted to uh, be an FBI agent and then be in law enforcement. And that was a desire of mine throughout um, high school when I was young. Um, just actually watching the story, the FBI story. With, and I used to watch it all the time, every time it came on TV. That, uh, it, it's black and white, but that uh, really uh, drew me to the FBI, understanding um, what it did. And because of the FBI story, I wanted to come in an FBI and work espionage and counterintelligence um, matters, and that's what I ended up doing. When I finally got into the FBI in 1997 and, and arrived at the academy, I was the only African American in my class of 50. Uh, there were seven African Americans in the classes above me, but they all graduated. And at one particular point in time, we were having classes every two weeks. Uh, I was the only African American agent walking around at the academy. And there were classes coming in every two weeks um, during that time period in 97 to make up for the hiring freeze uh, at that time. So it was pretty interesting for me. And I think it's very important for any law enforcement organization to mirror the community that it serves. Um, if you don't have that, you cannot connect uh, with that community because that's the first um, thing that they see and trust. If they see someone like themselves, um, then that may take down a barrier to helping you to solve some of the issues and challenges that any community may have. Um, it is the diversity of thought. Um, it is also bringing in individuals um, who have different backgrounds um, that are rich um, and that can contribute um, to any community, but also can contribute to solving any problem that uh, you may face. I think for, for me to recognize African-American agents is uh, one of the greatest things that the Bureau could do, um, to recognize the diversity uh, within its ranks, um, to recognize those who have sacrificed along with all of our brothers and sisters who serve within the Bureau, um, is amazing. Um, I think over time um, in our history, um, a, a lot of folks who have a different background, a different race as African Americans, we are overlooked um, in our history at times. And I, and I believe that this is one of the most important things that the Bureau could do um, to help long term in building a great foundation of individuals who care about this country, who are diverse, who are African American, who want to serve in a different capacity. And um, the struggle still continues, um, but we have to have people who are willing to step forward and take, take on that challenge to, to you know, take the man on. If I see talent in someone, if I see an ability and a drive in someone, and I think that they can offer something to the Bureau, I strongly uh, recommend um, that they seek that out. Um, I speak to them about my particular experience and what um, the Bureau can offer them uh, because it offered me so much. It offered me opportunities that I, I never dreamt of uh, during my career.